Hey everyone, Charlene Bauer, Ladies Opera Network, and we are live at 5 on a Tuesday, and we are ready to play. Yes, uh, it is our five-day trip skills camp week. It's time to have some fun, and we already have ladies showing up, and we have more ladies coming because, of course, it's Taco Tuesday, so why would you be late for dinner? I know, I get it. Uh, hello, everybody. Make sure you're saying your hellos. But the big headliner is Moab is in two weeks. Who's going to come to my birthday? Who's going to be part of the birthday bash? Are we going to have some fun? You're going to do it? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. So I just answered a text message today. Can I bring my stock Rubicon? Yes. Yes, you can. Absolutely. And not only that, you're going to have a great time. Now, on the cup one day, you might have to pull a passenger seat, but trust me, it'll be worth it for the whole rest of the trip, right? Uh, we have a Toyota coming. Yes, yes you can. Like, it doesn't matter. Don't feel like you or your vehicle are not capable enough of coming and having a great time. We will manage that conversation and we will make sure that you have a great time. Now, does that mean you're not going to be pucker butted the entire week? That's up to you. <laughs> That's on your challenge. That's on your schedule <laughs> if you're pucker butted the whole week. But let's work through it and you are going to have a good time. So we still have spaces available for Moab in two weeks. Make sure that you look it up. Ladiesoffernetwork.com. Uh, you're going to have to go directly to our Wild Apricot, which if you go to register for any event with Ladies Opera Network, you will find it there. It's only a direct link. And Bonnie, if you can drop that direct link in there from last week's email, that would be amazing. Uh, so if you're looking to join us in Moab, it's a direct link only. There's not a big marketing splash on it. Uh, this is my birthday bash and you are invited. That's the way that's going to go. Uh, next, Scavenger Hunt. Bauer Academy is in full swing. We are having a blast. And this week's Scavenger Hunt items came from a class that we're putting together right now. It's how to work on your 4x4. And so I just wanted to give all the ladies a little taste of what's to come and how that looks and what that looks like and how much work it is to put it together and why it's taken so long and a lot of other words there. Uh, so yes, it's going to be uh, a blast once we finally get it out. There's a lot of information that's available and that is in the scavenger hunt right now, but soon it will be available. Bauer Academy offered education for guys, girls, kids, everybody. There's going to be all kinds of opportunity for you to be successful there. Uh, so the scavenger hunt is in full swing. I'm loving seeing the pictures. Not only are they submitting pictures into our email so that we can log them as a pass so that they can go into the drawing, but they're also posting it into our WhatsApp chat, which then gives everybody the opportunity to learn and be successful with, you, with each other, which I think is really important as far as our group goes. So the scavenger hunt is well underway and having a blast at it. Yes, there's, <laughs> there's a lot more to come. And yes, they get more random from here. <laughs> some are easy, some are hard. Just remember, that's the whole, <laughs> the whole point. Uh, just recently, I got off the phone with off the phone, off of a call, off of our online call, I guess is the best way to say it, with some rad moms. Yes, so we have ladies off our network moms that took an hour out of their busy day. We only had one mom picking up a kid at school. It was pretty awesome. Uh, but all the moms got on for a quick minute to talk about how to have a better kids experience as far as ladies off our network goes. So what I was basically told is kind of what I realized afterwards is a five day trip with your kids is a little more than what most moms want. They're like uh, camping, maybe two days, Charlene, maybe two days. Can we just make it an overnight? <laughs> so uh, we really worked through all of those conversations. We worked through the win. We worked through how we should do this. Um, the one thing I loved, 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 and uh, if you agree, I would appreciate some yeses or hearts or something after I'm done with the comment. But 
we decided, we decided, meaning Lisa came up with the word tracks. And so we had two tracks when we were talking about it. Like we had a younger track and then we had an older kid track, right? Because they learn differently. And, and I agree, no different than what I had planned for us this year was a younger kid trip and then an, a bigger kid trip, right? Because they learn different. I get it. So if we have it on the same weekend, have two different tracks. We're potentially the same activity, but just different levels of learning. No problem. And then we added a third track by the end of the call, like a half hour later, this third track made itself very present and available where the mom says, I want to learn how to do this, but I also want my daughter or son to learn how to do this. So if something was to happen, they can help. I'm like, what a brilliant idea. Yes. So we can do how to change a tire or how to use your winch. But with the mom doing the hands-on and the kid right there helping so that then when it is time to change that tire or it is time to use that winch, the kid can also be successful and they can be helpful and they can be a part of it, right? So um, yeah, what do you guys think? Do you love that idea too? So there's going to be three tracks <laughs> within the weekend uh, that makes it stand out. So I'm pretty excited about that concept. There was some other stuff that they talked about that was really a cool idea too. Uh, I'm going to let it filter through my brain. And then what happens next is we have our leadership team that gets together in November. Our leadership team will talk through everything that we did here in 2021 and say, hmm, how'd it go? And then say, okay, Charlene, this is what we want to do in 2022. And I'll look at them like, oh my gosh, how am I going to pull all that off? And then we'll figure it out. <laughs> so that's the plan uh, there. But yes, I'm already planning 2022 programs. Uh, we had our very first show. If you guys are on my personal Facebook page, you saw that. I will be pushing it over to Lady Software Network here in a little bit. But we had our first show, the Sand Sports Super Show, which to me is always the first show of the year that really dictates how the industry is doing, how the rest of the shows are going to go, and what's happening. This place was packed, and it was packed in California. So uh, with all due respect, I will have to say it's time to get out and live a life, ladies. If you are in a state that is challenging, I apologize, and I know you're frustrated as much as everybody else is. But it's time to get out and live a life and let's go have some fun. Uh, your outdoor experience is what you should be doing, number one. And if I can help you at any point in time, in any way, get that done, please let me know how. And it may not be one of our programs. It may, it may say, Charlene, none of this works for me. None of this works for my calendar. This doesn't work for me personally. Like, this is what I need. Okay, let's make a plan. I had somebody say that to me and I'm like, cool. Let's make a plan. And so now we have a plan and we're going to execute that plan in a few weeks. So uh, never hesitate to ask, never hesitate to say, I need something different. This is what I'm after. How can you make this work for me? All right. Um, but if you're looking at the calendar, there is a lot going on. <laughs> Remember, September, it says, if you're t if you get tired, learn to rest, not to quit. Like, go, go, go. Gotta go. Uh, so this is our skills camp this weekend. We have this last one of 2021. Like everything is coming to a close. It's crazy. And then in October next month, in two weeks, two and a half weeks, we have Moab. Please let me know if you want to come. Let's make that work for you. There's no skill set, no vehicle limitation. You will be just fine. Now you might pucker just a little bit on skill and vehicle limitation but we'll get you through and you're gonna have a great time uh the very next weekend is our top 10 weekend so i have a group of ladies here Woo! do i have some entertainment value for you girls lined up you better take a couple naps before you come fyi <laughs> and then we have uh, SEMA, which we have all kinds of great opportunities there. And then our Leadership Summit weekend is the weekend right after. That's when I'll be speaking with all of the ladies about our 2022 plans. Um, and then in November, we have our trail training. So that's our two-day trail training class. We already have a group of ladies signing up. I'm very excited about what this looks like. Reminder, on the Friday, we also have 
your tread lightly tread lightly tread trainer program lots of tread and trainers and words around here <laughs> uh, so that is on friday the 19th so we put that into play if you want to get certified we have a certification class tomorrow that we're certifying some ladies we have another group that will then be november 19th followed by the two-day trail training class here in arizona um then we just end a bunch of stuff like our resolution ends the scavenger hunt ends and with that though we start our 12 days of giving so 12 days of giving if you haven't been a part of it before is very intense it's 12 days of live at five and i give away all kinds of cool stuff but what i'm also going to do is be talking to you about what's coming in 2022 so for anybody that hasn't been part of our world you know your calendar in december ish there's a few dates that i won't put down and you will know that and i will be very specific about that but for the 80 percent you know the calendar in december so you can plan ahead and make sure that you are taking care of yourself and what we have going on uh in december is our last opportunity to get together high five each other feel some dirt under our tires and that's for the end of year bash and that will be december 10th through the 12th uh, i was just looking it's going to be 149 it is a hangout day on friday just casual enjoy each other saturday is a casual dirt day we'll do something in the dirt and then Sunday we will have racing and we will have a couple other things uh, to finish off our race series strong this year. <laughs> I mean, it's been aggressive year of racing here for sure. If you don't know what I mean, you need to figure out what I mean. <laughs> you need to get here so we can have fun. Uh, so that ends up 2021, like very fast on the move here, but lots and lots and lots to do. So yes, get here, get to Moab, get, 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 and let's have some fun. Ashley is coming to Moab. Aren't you exciting? I know. So uh, make that commitment to yourself. Make that commitment to enjoying the outdoors and let's have a blast together. It's everybody's birthday that week, by the way. Don't you know? <laughs> Don't you know? <laughs> um, and then, yeah from there we just move on to 2022 but there's still a lot of success that you can get done i do want to also mention the resolution there's a bunch of you that are part of our ladies off-road resolution that started in january where you built goals for yourself i built goals for myself as well and um, i want you to reflect on some of those goals right now i just accomplished one and i totally didn't even realize that i had accomplished it until somebody else pointed it out so check out your goal set see where you're at with them and let's get some chat chat going on the chitter chat chat of the resolution and let's finish this year off strong it started off awkward but it's going to finish strong and you know it and you know it because you are doing it all right ladies you guys have a great night it's taco tuesday enjoy your tuesday tacos and uh we are going to get going with the skills camp here I'm so excited. I love it when everything comes together. Have a great night. Appreciate you all very, very much. Good night.